So a viewer from up the country sent me their grandfather's saw to restore, so we'll do that tonight. There we go. I'm going to get all the teeth like this and take another hammer, and I'm just going to drive them against each other. That will wedge all the teeth together so that they don't have a curve. Now to actually remove the rust, we'll use the ancient process of WD-40, sandpaper, rag, repeat. So this is a mixture of the rust and WD-40, and when you wipe it down, it's very satisfying just to see it all come off. To sharpen the saw, I just have it sandwiched between two pieces of spruce like this. We just need to hold the triangular file at a bit of an angle when we're sharpening it. So I have the teeth sharpened now. I'm just going to pull a piece of wood over there. We can see we are taking a cut. Now remember how we hammered them all flat earlier? I need to use this fella called a saw set. And I'm just going to go to every second tooth. And that will allow a curve, basically a wider gap than the body of the saw. So the saw can pass through without getting jammed. All that's left to do now is test her out. So I have a piece of ash here in the vise. But that's a very clean cut there. 